Hi and welcome to this video. In this video I'm going to be showing you some techniques to how to get data back from very scratched disks or damaged disks. Now maybe you've got a DVD or CD ROM drive, a CD disk or HD disk or even a Blu-ray disk. You can actually use software to try and get that data back. Okay, now you can see a picture in front of us of the damaged disk and you may want to get precious photos or something like that back, school work or whatever it may be. Okay, now there is a chance of getting it back, obviously there's no guarantee, but I'm going to be showing you some freeware software that you can use to try and get it back. So the first one we're going to be looking at today is a recovery toolbox for CD, okay? If you come to this website, uh, www.recoverytoolbox.com and download the program, it's an actual freeware and as I said it will actually get data back from these types of CDs, HD, Blu-ray, DVD and CD, okay? and obviously it shows you some pictures down here that you can actually see once you've installed okay so once you've installed that I'm gonna give it a scan so what we're gonna do now is I've downloaded it to my desktop and I'm gonna to try to install this program now for you and it's just basically click on it go run then next just go next again just leave it in the default C drive where it wants to go let that happen click next again and install we're going to launch the program and this is where so what it wants you to do now it wants you to put a, a disk in there so what we could do is actually put a disk in so I'm just going to quickly uh, lob a disk in there to see what uh, obviously I haven't got no damaged disks here but obviously let's just quickly wait on in there that's the disk in and once that's got a disk obviously it's going to scan for that drive find the, uh, the actual CD in there and then you just click on next and let that just load there's no damage to the disk so I just want to see there you go so it's actually found it okay so what we need to do now it just wants to Go next. So we're going to put it on there. CD restored. Okay, this is the directory where it wants to put the files once it's restored them. So we're going to go next at this stage. And this is basically what it's found on the CD. So as you can see now, it's found all these files on the CD. So if if there was a damage to this CD it would recover the actual parts that you could recover from the CD so all you'd have to do now is put ticks in the ones that you want say for instance it was photographs or something of that nature okay you would just put the tick in there, uh, tick in there to, to recover those files okay obviously if you don't want to recover them just don't put the ticks in just take these ticks out I'm just going to do one actually because obviously I don't want to back all this crap up because it's actually a disk I'm just going to do this one here just to show you and there goes save and there you go that's the file that's been taken off that CD now granted this is a, a, a CD that is actually in working order but if you had a damaged disk you could actually try to recover those files from that disk so that was actually uh, the recovery toolbox for CD there is another one you could try which is called roguehill.net and there's one L on that kill and basically uh, come to this site and download this program this is another good one I would always try at least two uh, because obviously sometimes one might be better than others at certain sort types of discs so I always try to do um, two, two tests with two different types of software okay so this is the other one we're not going to go through this one I think I've got it um, there we go it's up here so I'm going to download that let's just quickly install that then I'll just quickly have a little look and show you just going to quickly install this program okay and as you can see this is the road kills unstoppable copier you just come in here this looks a little bit more uh, source so it wants to actually go for the source so you actually pick your source file where you want to go to okay like uh, the CD ROM drive okay like so so for instance that's my CD ROM click OK and then the target which is obviously where you want to send it to okay so you have to do that manually and then copy and it will try and read the disk and actually 
uh, try and read the disc for to get the data off that off that uh, CD. Okay, I'm not too sure about all this. Um, never, I've not used this one before. I've used the other one, but um, I'm pretty sure it's straightforward. You just mainly copy the data from the disc if it can do it. Okay, and just put the ticks in here where it says corrupted files, skip files, and copied files. So that's the actual road kills version. Now I know you may be saying. Uh, what about um, Linux users? Well, I have found something on Linux. If you do have a Linux machine, apparently this is the site here. You can go to. It's called DD Rescue Data Recovery Tool. And basically, if you come to here, it's uh, www.gnu.org. Okay, and then it'll be under software, and it'll be DD Rescue. And if you come down here and have a little look, it will show you the download there. You can actually download the file from there and these are the actual commands that you can actually use that I found I found this on the internet in case you Linux guys want to uh, do the same job okay so that's basically all that done uh, the only other thing I want to show you at the end of the day is if that doesn't work and you're in a bit of a pickle the only other thing you can do is there's toothpaste uh, that you can use bring the disk onto a nice clean surface rub toothpaste around in around in circles all over the disc to try and scrub the disc clean with tissue and uh, toothpaste let it sit there for a while to clean it up and it should go cleaning uh, uh, should go shiny and also the last result is using the good old-fashioned Brasso which actually also cleans discs so you can actually after you've done the toothpaste you can actually use a bit of Brasso stick that on the on the actual thing and go around in circles and then what make sure it's nice and clean before you actually put it into the, the actual disk drive and that should get rid of a lot of minor scratches and scra uh, other scratches off the disk and it may help you just recover those vital files that you want okay and if that doesn't work then you've just got yourself a nice little coaster for your cup of coffee all right my name is brian from brightech.co.uk i hope this video has been some use to you please show your support by subscribing to my channel and uh, leave your comments good or bad it doesn't matter uh, thanks very much for watching bye for now